Hey guys, it's me, Rachel, and I'm going to do my sketchbook tour for you guys. So this sketchbook is uh, one of the 12th grade graduation presents that I got. So yeah, even though I was, even though I was already um, uh, sketching in another one, I flip flop. It's a bad habit, but I always do it no matter what, and I lived it. I'm still flip flopping between the first two, flip flopping between. This one I have right here, and then a small one that's still more over there. But where I'm gonna show in this one, because this one is the most filled out of all my other ones. So let's hop into this. So in the front page is uh, caricature since I work at the Philadelphia Zoo and I started doing the caricature artist and everything. So yeah, that's this one. And I was experimenting with the color strips because even though I had it for a while now, I actually ain't, I'm still not good with color strips. If those, who, if those of you who do not know what color strips are, they're, they're like crowns, I guess you would call it crowns, but it just did not crown consistency, it just didn't look like crowns. But yeah, it's just a random doodle. More random doodles. Very tiny. And I use and I also don't draw on the back because sometimes something smudges or I use <laughs> or I use marker and it kinda like bleeds through. So I just I avoid that. I always done that. I'm starting to get you in front and back with my with my small ones so hopefully. So yeah, that's one. Here's the other. Not caricature, but as Starting to random tattoos on people now, so yeah. And I always draw piercings. Piercings are are nice to draw. I I, I draw them a lot. So throughout this whole entire flip through, you're gonna see piercings. Yep. Here's one random doodle, which I actually don't mind, but I don't color it all mine or outline all mine. Only if I feel like it. Here's another one. This is random too. Yep. I was just trying out, well, just using some, like, hair, two different hair colors and practicing on my sh shadow, like, these shadows. It looks better on camera, but in real life, it's actually not that, like, strong to pick up, though. And here's this one, which... I drew way, way before, didn't finish it, and then I'm like, let me just go back and color this in, so yeah, pretty much, and I, I like gore, so that explains all that, <laughs> and then here's some more caricatures, this is, uh, there's, there's some more, so these are the characters of some of my friends and classmates that I had at my high school, so yep, yeah. here's another one. This is of my friend Tara. So. And my friend Ivy. And this is not really a caricature, but I want to do the picture anyway. This is of my friend Apple. So, yeah. And here is where I was. Do, uh, not pinned up or nothing. It's just, I just wanted to draw something different that I usually don't draw a lot. So, yeah. So yeah, mint hair, and I was getting tattoos too, so, well, more in depth, but yeah, there's that one, and here's this one, this is, like, my favorite, kind of, <laughs> here's this one, like I said, these, these shadows are picking up better on camera than it is in real life, <laughs> Who would have thought? This one was. This is when I started getting the outlining a little bit, but. That's it. Here's another one. I didn't realize that her neck is, is a little thin, but I think I like it that way. Yeah, I like gore. Yeah. 
I'm very weird. It's okay. I know I am. Here's this one. Some reason the brown didn't want to work. Oh, my color pencil was acting weird. So it looks very blotchy a little bit, but yeah. I like this one. Yeah. Here's this one. I did this one because I baked and stuff, so I took a picture of me vaping. Yeah, it's really weird, all of it. And I just got, so I just did one that I liked a lot, so I did the smoke of that, so. My smoke rings, because I ain't trying to, I can, drawing smoke rings is kind of hard. Okay, I'm just jumping on my shoe, okay. And like I said, a lot of piercings. <laughs> Here's this one. I should go for like pirate-ish. It looks more like pirate slash lieutenant of some sort. I don't even know. It just went in that direction. And here's a ninja. That snake came out better than I thought it would. Came out better than I thought. And I don't draw snakes like that. Uh, just, just trying a different shirt style because I don't draw shirts like this, like that. So, yeah, there's that one. And I used highlighter for this one because I got bored and I want to use a club pencil, so I started using highlighter. Yep. I was draw I was good at I drew something on this and then I erased it and then apparently I scribbled. Did not know I scribbled all this. And this is when I got my um man the mini wooden mannequin things that you use for drawing. I got one of those, so it can help with this. I don't draw hands a lot, so the hand's a little wonky, but it's okay. I gotta cut this on my hands though. And then, here you go, sitting position, i never done like that, so, I did the best that I could do, so it's okay. There's a fairy on a cat, and I like jolly mushrooms, which, they don't like mushrooms right now, but I might go back and color it later, don't know. <laughs> and then, random pose, random girl posing so I just want to do a spotlight so I might come back and finish this I don't know and this is color pencil and then I use my my Crayola uh, crown twist crown sticks for the hair because I didn't want to do all that with color pencil which actually for crown doesn't look that bad. So yeah. Here's that one. And I usually don't draw two eyes of you as you notice. But I'm I'm trying to get into why I said a one with a wink or both closed or covered with hair or something. But yeah. I like this one. And then one of my friends, one of my friends, so just suggested to me to just do like some marshmallow, draw a marshmallow person or something. So that's what I did. Mr. M Mr. Marshmallow. Yep. Like I said, can draw hands, but it's okay. And I play Overwatch, so there is like the ultimate set this the ultimate phrases of different characters so diva mccree reaper and soldier 76 because i mean soldier 76 and mccree i played diva a couple times not really good reaper i don't i, I just can't 
it, it, it's like, I just can't play it. It's, it's hard for me to play, to play him. Yeah. I kind of messed up with the hair, so I had to add bangs, so I messed up with the eyes. And I was about to go and um, ink it, so I might just... I am going to come back to this, though, because it does look nice. Mine is the minor mishap, but... Yeah. And this is a page of just random stuff. That thumb is not a thumb, but let's not, you know, whatever. Random kitty. Ears. Yeah, eyes and stuff. Okay. I was trying to, I was trying to draw a, a Chinese man, but, or a Chinese inspired, but, I don't draw men like that. I draw girls a lot, as you can tell from my, uh, past stuff, but yeah. Uh, and then, actually, I, I should stop. But this, I wanted to, I wanted to, you know, Press on my shattering some more. So I just created this mini thing on the piece of paper <laughs> and stuff. So I like how it turned out. Wish all my shadow was like that, but you know, can't wish for everything. So yeah. And then that's it for this one. I legit have four pieces left. And these are all my prints in the back, but testing prints. And since we finished that, uh, this was a sketchbook that I'm recently in, so let's go and flip through that. Here you have nerdy things. I'm not going to get into that for right now. I have some caricatures in here. This is the first caricature. It's like kind of Star Wars inspired, kind of not. Then you have more caricatures, just trying different different things. Like I said, two eyes are kind of hard. You need characters for me. I have no clue what I was thinking about in this one. Just try something different. Yeah, more mini caricatures. This is the witch thing that I did earlier. 2017, I, I date most of mine, so yeah. Just trying to draw a fairy. This was a fake tattoo that I had on my arm that lasted a while, and I liked it. And I did a painting of it, which I'll show you some other time. I was seeing if watercolor could actually, like, stay in the page, and actually, it can. But, yeah. Random scribbles. There'll be some random scribbles for the next, like, couple pages. Yeah. Oh, it's so cool. This is what happens when you watch magic school books. Yep. Oh, now the circle. Now it's something that will need out. I think I'm trying to draw a rhyme next to the the constellation, but I don't, I don't think you can. I, I don't know if if I just la went lazy about it or didn't want to do anything about it. So it's just that. Yeah. Random characters. Some. You hear this? And then like random little oops, landscapes and stuff. And I didn't like to really can't do it, but. Is it mom Marie random curl? And then here I saw this a little bit during like October, so I'll see like one of my favorite drawings out of the out of the series that I did at this one. So little little devils. And then you have I guess kind of interpretation of Frankenstein. And then you have a vampire, a little, with two little bats, the blood 
kind of look weird now after I look at it. So, oh, missing, missing, something. And then we have like, I did, I like clocks. I like clocks. I got pump watch too. So, like, clock, pocket. I like Night Eye Moody's eye and stuff. So, I'm like, I did kind of like that. And then a clock, a clock on wing, with wings and the clock inside her chest. So, yep. And then, all seeing eye. I forgot what I called this when I put it on Instagram, but yeah. Yep. Random dude. I like to, I'll try, I'll actually just screw him because I was trying to practice on my beard and mustaches. Random side. Side view of a girl blowing bubble gum. And this is one of the videos that I have on my, um, on my art channel right now. And this is just figuring out what hairstyles I want to draw next. I did this one. I want to see that. I inked this yesterday. Here we go. And this is the one I drew yesterday and I inked today. Yeah. And then that's it. So if you guys enjoyed this video and make sure you make sure to like and subscribe and I see you next time.